Abend, Damen und Herren. Ich bin also die Marina und wie ihr vielleicht hören und sehen könnt, komme ich genau wie Abba und so weiter aus äh, Ikea. Und, äh, aber ich werde euch von diesem Möbelakzent äh, befreien und zu Englisch wechseln. I am here to talk about extremely advanced puzzles. Well, not exactly this puzzle, and also not the ones that you get at Ikea that are supposed to turn into wardrobes magically, but uh, about puzzles where the pieces don't really match. I research how models for complex systems can be combined. Let's back up a little bit. Do you know how engineers design complex systems? Well, imagine an airplane. It consists of thousands of components. You have the wings, the jet engines, a bunch of electronics, computers, softwares for those computers. They're all designed by separate experts, but for this system to work as intended, they all need to interact correctly. And there are millions of these interactions. If you change something here, you might change how the whole global network of airplanes flying in the sky on autopilot behaves. Therefore, I am researching ways to combine different aspects of complex systems to give a better picture. Now, building prototypes of each component is too expensive before knowing that they will actually work. Therefore, we use mathematical and simulation models and these are the pieces that I'm trying to fit together. Now look at this airplane again. This piece of paper is actually a pretty good demonstrator of the flight principle, oh, well, when designed correctly. Um, and here we have another model, a mathematical one. Some of you might know it as Newton's second law. It describes how a force that's acting on a body, in this case, is pulled towards the ground. This is of course also true for this airplane. So here, we have two fully functional, perfect models that describe two very different aspects of the same system. Now you can see that they are pieces in a puzzle that's very, very difficult to somehow put together. So since I'm not gonna change the shape of these puzzle pieces, I need something else. I'm going to need some very good glue. So, through my research, I'm looking for this glue in the shape of a computer-based system that, first of all, shows how these are connected, and second of all, can transfer this information from one model into the other in an effective and reliable way. So in the end, you can see it's not very different from IKEA furniture. If you know how the pieces are related, and with very good glue, you'll have a perfect wardrobe. Thank you. Thank you.